Who lit that up? Can you do it again? Can you light that up again? You're not going to do it now? Those voices weren't very clear that I reviewed. I think I heard a priest is here instead of a beast is here. Which is still a strange thing to say. And I heard something lord. How many spirits are here with me right now, if any? How many spirits are here? Please speak in the box on the floor. Slow and clear. You could light up something with an antenna or the cat balls, motion balls. Please. The valley. What about the valley? Try some spirit names I've heard before. Is Joe or Joseph here? Which I don't think are the same person. Spirit. Um, Christopher, Elizabeth, Robert. What else have I heard? Uh, Francis. Uh, William. Shane. Shane was a recent one. And another guy, I'm drawing a blank on his name. Was it Justin? I don't remember. Hello, Tim. Hello, Tim? Yeah, actually, Tim is one, too. Are you saying hello to Tim? Or are you Tim? Hmm? There was a guy, I can't think of his name, from Modesto that died on Mitchell Road. What was his name? What? Do you mind me having the flashlight on? Not flashlight, but flash light. Always gets out of focus so easy. Can you light up something on the counter here? Maybe one of these four clear cat ball motion balls. Can you light those up, please? So I can see that you're here and show other people that you're here. We've mainly been making that K2 flicker, and then I think this thing went off once or twice. And this in the very beginning, this REM pod here, before I even got the spirit box on. About the purple lantern, can you make that flash to the top rainbow colors? Yeah. Where are you guys? I wanted to know if you were going to join me in Rock Chinatown on the ghost tour that I'm doing this Saturday.
6 p.m. to 10 p.m. in Lock Chinatown. You can find it on Facebook. Or you can contact my name, Ryan Prive, P R I V E E. Or look up Ghost. Uh, online. Online, yes. Look up Central Valley Historical Ghost Tours or CV Historical Ghost Tours on Facebook. Of course, I'm at home right now. I'm not in lock. Lock is much creepier. Um, it's forty dollars a person, cash and arrival, and thirteen year old or older. Nobody under thirteen, and you must be with an adult if you're a minor. Please do not show up drunk. I know there is a bar in the neighborhood. All the wops. Hello. You guys are very quiet tonight. You don't know what's wrong? I don't know what's wrong either. Who are you, ma'am? I'm going to turn this off for now. What about people? I came to hear about them. Didn't I hear about them? What are you talking about? What happened? You have some go some gossip? What happened? Do I have any new visitors here? Anybody new that I don't that's Spanish. Sound like tranquil. Can you knock on this bathroom door here? If you guys sometimes do that, little light knocks. Might be hard to hear with the portal going. It's almost like a little kid lightly knocking. I don't know if they'll do it. Sometimes they do it when the dog sashes on the other side, but of course the dog can't do. Can't. No, she can't. I know you can't. What'd you say? Um, but the dog doesn't have knuckles to knock like that really fast. So. Having trouble understanding. I thought I heard something about pineapple. What? That's kind of random. Believe in God. Do you believe in God? I heard that. Yes, I do. Do you? Got some religious spirits here again. I kind of get different groups and. Sometimes it's religious ones, and sometimes it's mischievous, snarky, sarcastic ones, or downright rude. Sometimes it's creepy ones, and sometimes it's ones that need help and are lost and confused, or just wanting to have a conversation. Are you spirits all human? Or were you human? I don't know what you consider yourselves now. I guess if you're not with a corporal body, you're not 
technically human, but you were human. You still think and converse like a human. What are your names? Tell me your names. Can you speak loud, slow, and clear, please? Maybe light something up. Cat balls? Can you light up the cat balls? Aaron here. I heard that. Okay. I don't think I've met you before. Where are you from, Aaron? I'll turn this up just a little bit. It'll be noisier, but kind of help hear the voices better. Aaron, are you here? Where are you from? The neighbor's son used to be Aaron, but they moved. Aaron, where are you from? Are you still here? Hello? Just that, but it's not really helping. Aaron, where are you from? It's too loud, I'm gonna turn it down. Okay, back down you go. You're just gonna have to speak a little clearer there. Did you leave, Aaron? Where'd you go? Are you looking for help, Aaron? I heard something. I don't know what that was. Did you tap on the wall? Hello? Where did you go? You're here one moment and gone the next. What's that about? Did you lose your energy? I think that's what happens when they do that. They start talking and then they quit talking. Of course, not all spirits do that, but a lot of them do. Aaron, answer me. Where are you? Where'd you live? Where was your home before? Do you remember? I always assume they do remember, but I mean, you never know. 
I love you. You love what? What do you love, ma'am? Um, ma'am, who are you? I'm gonna play that back because I think I heard her say I love it here, but I'm not sure. And that's something they never say. So that would be interesting if that's what she said. Of course, what is here? Is she talking about where she's at? Purgatory or my home or what? I don't know. Where do you love it, ma'am? Hello?